promptly for the Old Firm game the following week. Celtic went into the match seven points behind their great rivals. Paul McStay must let fly at the shoot through. Brilliantly saved. That's a long one, and Mick McCarthy in for that. Dominating in the air as he was in Germany on Tuesday, but I thought he was quite superb for Celtic. Organised them well and inspired them. Feels for a penalty, it is. A handling offence. A low draw, and Rangers, who had an appeal earlier on, turned down, get the penalty. The referee right on the spot saw a hand, a hand used. Now, here it was, off it went, and it came, I think, either off the hand of Rogan or McCarthy. Now, normally, Davy Cooper or Ali McCoyce would take uh, penalties. And certainly a hard one for this man, Mark Walters, at this stage. There he goes. He's done it. Straight through the goalkeeper. He didn't even bother angling it. Watch this. The goalkeeper undecided, but Walters certainly was not. It's wide and against Rogan the chance to go to the line. Well, that's the wrong way. And Stevens right off balance. Another free kick, and you can see how well McGee troubles the defence by turning quickly like that. There he is, ex Abadonian, ex Hamburg. And it's all pushing and shoveling in there just now, isn't it? Oh, that's a long goal! <laughs> Terry Butcher! An own goal by Rangers captain. He was trying to clear that for a corner. And now it's one all. Brown took his eye off that, seemed to have it well covered. McAvenny, well away. Stark, now McStay. McAvenny, a little bit too much, I think. Now the Celtic at the corner kick. Trying to keep the pressure on, Rangers. Try and find McCarthy again. And Ferguson, none too sure of himself. And here's Tommy Burns. Lofting it in. Mark McGee turning on it. Oh, he's got it through. Mark McGee scoring for Celtic. That makes it 2 1. With the Rangers defence standing stranded. And the pressure has paid off. There it was, Buns in there. Now watch the number of Celtic players on the right then. How he got it through the crowded bodies. McAvenny. McAvenny playing very well for Celtic, leading the line well. That was Ian Ferguson. Ian Ferguson in direct competition with Paul McStay. And they both come through the ranks together, these players. Professional youth team and know each other very well.
nicely fed out there by Aiken. McGee over in there, and that's a third one. Scott. Billy Stark gets Celtic's third goal. Oh, that was delightful play by Celtic. It was a very tight range of defence. And then it came to Stark and it was an in-off. I think it came off uh, Brown eventually. just gets there and it's a free kick saying he leant over his back there's no use complaining about it a lot of arguing going on there that ranges the fence and it goes to McStay there's the shot brilliantly saved oh a magnificent shot Matched by a superb piece of goalkeeping, as you can see, whizzing in. A brilliant 3-1.